The pace of living is obviously faster than ever. For a young, pretty girl, there are so many parties to go to, there just isn't time to get hair washed and set. Well, here's one answer, change it. Actresses, models, and other busy people are turning more and more to using wigs for convenience. An unexpected date, you just pop one on, choosing either the black or the auburn to suit the dress. Models find that agencies wanting a blonde or brunette can easily be satisfied with same girl, different wig. The hair is bought mainly in Italy, costing sometimes 18 shillings an ounce, and because of its rarity, blonde hair is the most expensive. The task of making a wig is not simple. For a rush job, it requires three days of concentrated work. It's made by first measuring the customer's head and then the hairline. From these figures is prepared a foundation of special lace into which is fitted about six ounces of hair. Each hair is individually knotted into place on the foundation. When the wig is made, the hair must be shampooed and styled, so under the dryer it goes. Then the hair will be set in an up-to-the-second style, and there's no tedious waiting around for the person who's going to wear it either. In this London firm of wig creations, there is a stock of 8,000 wigs, all constantly in demand, particularly for television and stage plays. Wigs have been worn by men and women down the centuries. In ancient Rome, even the statues had them. Could it be that it's time for the fashion to come back in a big way? Today's teenagers are perhaps more fashion conscious than their parents. Here's one who might be setting the pace for the rising generation. Actresses, models, busy party girls all have wigs. Why not the teenagers?